Stony Brook is world renowned for the researchers here in terms of human evolution um, and more broadly physical anthropology and part of that is because of our collaboration with the anatomy department. My research is focused on human evolution and, and I always say it's hominin phylogenetics so to unpack what that means phylogenetics is studying how everything is related to one another and hominins are our human ancestors so all of the fossils leading up to humans. To study what I study, most fossils are in the form of teeth, for better or worse, and that's because of the way that they fossilize, they're heavily mineralized. So I end up studying a lot of teeth. We actually just made a collaboration with the Stony Brook Dental School, where I'm using their scanner that they actually use for dental implants to make 3D models of teeth so that I can gather, make these 3D meshes of teeth and study how their shapes are different between the different fossils. The broader significance of my research and how it applies to people more broadly is understanding how humans became the way humans are. And I think it should be interesting to everyone. And there's a reason that we always see human evolution on the cover of Nat Geographic, and that's because people want to know where they came from. The Interdepartmental Doctoral Program in Anthropological Sciences, or we refer to it as IDPASS, is an extremely rigorous program. But at the same time, when we go to conferences, we've already been through the question and answers and when we apply for jobs we have a huge amount of teaching experience as well as a really diverse background in terms of coursework and research.